What's up guys, my name is Phil. Welcome back to Miranda Detailing. In today's video, it's just a quick review of this blower. So guys, this is what used to be West Force is now Aki Forced. Aki Forced, Achi Force. But it's a cordless leaf blower. So we have the battery in the back here. And you actually have a battery meter on here too, which is pretty cool. And oh, I'm about halfway down. So the battery meter here is indicating you got half power. So this guy comes with one battery, one charger, the blower, of course, and this will come apart. This whole piece here, it comes separated. Um, there's some pros and cons to this. It's a pretty powerful blower, but because of the large, um, you know, end here, it doesn't have that nice pinpoint. Um, action that I get from my other blowers that I'm going to show you on this full video of this vehicle uh, later on. But when you turn it on, that's max power. So it is a little loud. It is very comfortable to handle though. I like the handle up here. And then you have the, uh, it's no trigger, it's just the little indicator here. It goes all the way up to max, one, all the way up to max. So let's just show you how it works in blowing the vehicle dry. Now this is not intended for drying the entire vehicle. It's meant for cracks and crevices and things like that. The rest of it we towel dry with a nice fluffy uh, drying towel. So let's just show you what it is capable of and some of the pros and cons. So we just washed the vehicle, we just deconned it. It has no protection on it whatsoever. Now, if this had beads, that might be different. But let's turn it on and see what it can do as far as drying the front end and the wheels. Let's just see what it can do here. Yeah, if it has beads on it, way better.
All right, guys, so does it work? Yeah, it does. It has the power, and I love that it's cordless. It's pretty light, and it's well-balanced. However, here's a few adjustments that I would like to see with this blower. If it can come with a different attachment that goes to a narrower tip, you need to narrow this tip down to be able to uh, get into the cracks and crevices a lot better. The large orifice here at the end is just too big. It's good for leaves, that's really what it's intended for, but for drying a vehicle, I would like to see them include an attachment that either attaches to the end here of the blower and just narrows it down to a nice, you know, one inch or one and a half inch tip. Or this whole attachment does come apart like so, and you can, you know, be nice if you could put a different attachment to it that goes really narrow. That actually would probably be really, really nice if it came with that extra attachment like that. Um, because the shorter it is, I think the easier it is to handle. So if it would be, you know, about yay long, and it would just go to a nice narrow one inch point, I think that would really make a difference. Because it does have the power, it is slightly loud, but that's okay. But if it did have that narrower tip, yeah, I, I think it would dry the cracks and crevices a lot better. But we'll see what they can do for later models. I would suggest also that they give you at least two batteries. Um, the power on this is still halfway, so that's good. And I went around the vehicle for about five minutes or so. But if they can include two batteries for cordless options, for cordless tools, you need at least two or more batteries. One charger is fine because you're not going to be using this for prolonged periods of time if you're a detailer and using it this way. But if you're using it as a leaf blower, once the battery's dead, well, then you're dead in the water. So two batteries, guys. Two batteries would be much, much better with this. But so far, I love the design. I think it's great. Kind of reminds me of what the Ryobi ones that, that they have. Uh, might be very close to those models. So if uh, the AccuForce folks can make some of those improvements, I think it would go a long way. And I think this would be great for mobile detailers if it had that narrower point to it. It would be a really nice addition. And you can also hang this up. The charger does come... Uh, with little things in the back so you can actually put screws on a wall and hang the charger and this does too it actually has a little hole here so you can hang it up so either in your truck trailer or whatever your detailing place is here in the garage i'm going to find a place and hang it up i think that would be great so I'll, I'll continue to use it and we'll see if they can make an adjustment i might try to see if i can make my own tip here and uh, make it a little bit more useful for me. Again, if you want to pick it up for yourself and, and try it out, if you're in the market for a leaf blower, it would be great. But if you're a detailer, then it might be useful uh, for you as well. It did dry all of the areas, you know, along with a towel, which is the usual thing that we do. So give it a try for yourself if you want to see how it works. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great week. We'll see you next time.